There we go. Thank you, Lisa, for inviting me. And I'm going to try to do the best I can. Thank you, Mark. We're really excited to see what you come up with this year. You're welcome. I typically paint with um, ink on rice paper, which is very different than here where the pigment is absorbed immediately by the, by the clay, so it's very different. But the technique for me is, is like ink on rice paper, where I do leave a lot of more space to the white and to the space that, it, that in a way you try to capture the wind and the spirit that otherwise you would not capture. Uh, so it's a lot more free, it's a more, more symbolic, but I wanted to do something a bit more free this year. I think we've been all under a very heavy cloud. And I wanted to be something that was more life-giving. So there's more presence to the white. In other words, the white of the plate is not an absence, it's a presence in its own. And you just play with that. Yeah, just like it was a sheet of paper. Yeah. But it's fun. Let them dry and cook them. <laughs> <laughs> The brushes you're using, what are they made of? Those are all uh, animal fur. Rabbit, fox, wolf, hare, hogs, uh, horses a lot. Okay. Yeah. The, the larger the brush, the more the horses. This is when you're doing the splattering? Mm -hmm. Also, also, but also something not symmetrical and that, that works with the spirit, like a flow in it. Yeah, I love the movement. Yeah. Thank you.